Friday, and I want to tell you that I had to come on and do, I need to make a fire. I did my, my Bill's birthday thing earlier and had it in the can so I could get it out, but I need to make a fire today um, because it's Friday, and when I see somebody that's uh, feeling hurt, or grieving. I just like to make a fire, so maybe send some good vibes, some healing medicine, smoke, like my brother Nathan always says. Cat in the North, her family lost uh, a family pet. And, uh, <clears throat> and I know how it feels to lose a family member that's never spoken to you other than a bark or a meow or a tweet or whatever. I mean, uh, people get close to their pets. I mean, other than family members, they spend the most time around them. They care for them just like a child. So I could hear, I could hear her pain in her voice this morning when I saw that video. I've been thinking about it today. I've been working in the shop, working on some pieces, and I take a break every once in a while. I go back and catch up on some videos for Bill's birthday. I. I would like to say that I'm surprised by the outpouring of love from the community for Bill, but it doesn't surprise me not one bit. Not at all. What a good dude. But back to the point at hand. Cat, I hope this fire helps bring some, like I said, some positive vibes, and I'm thinking about you. I know how it feels to lose a a valued family member being a pet so i'm gonna make this little fire right here and shut my mouth and everybody have a great friday and again thanks for everything everybody's done for bill We're thinking of you, Cat. Hang in there.